Welcome back, my friends. Today, I'm going to show you how to create this slicing effect uh, with an object. All right, so let's get started. Now, I know you guys want to see the effect without having any fluff in between. So I'll try and work very quickly to create the or to recreate the object. All right, so I'm gonna start by bringing in a bottle of Corona beer. All right, so here's the image that I started with. So the first thing we need to do is remove the background. So I'm gonna come here, I'm gonna use my background remover and I'm going to remove the background. Now you'll notice the hand is still there and we need to get rid of the hand. So I'm gonna come back into the background remover and I'm going to try and very carefully remove the rest of that background. And if you take off too much you can always restore the image that are part of the image that you want to bring back. So don't worry if you've removed too much of the image. Okay, so all right, so there we go. Um, so I'm done, I'm going to go back, um, and now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to position this a little bit um, up here, and I see that my hand is still in there, so i got to go back in there, sorry about that. Right, there we go. Always wait for the save button. And there we go. It's saved now. Okay, so um, I'm just going to position that a little bit. And I am going to make a, um, a duplicate of that. And I'm just going to bring the duplicate down. And down here and then I'm going to take this one and I'm going to bring it up to here and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to find a beer splash and I'm going to go to my photos and it's so this is the one that I used right here and you'll notice that it's covering my beer bottle, meaning it has a white background. So we need to remove the background on that. Okay, so there we go. And now I'm just going to move this over the edge of my bottom beer bottle. And I'm just going to make it smaller because I want it to fit. I want it to, to size it. Okay, now I'm going to make a copy and I'm going to take that copy and I'm going to flip it both ways. Okay, so there we go. And now I am going to just move that down like so, so that it fits on the bottom of the top section. And there we go. Okay. And now what you can do is you can add a background. So I'm going to come back here and I'm going to search for a bar. And I'm going to make this my background. And then you can um, add some text in here. You can add any text you like. 
I'm just going to bring back this one, which I've copied over from my, from my original design. And basically, uh, if you want to see how I created this effect, just let me know in the comments. Um, I know that you guys like to skip through videos just to see the, the um, primary effect. So here it is. And then I just added some peanuts and a squirrel. Now, if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so that you're notified when new content comes out. Thanks for joining me, my friends, and until next time, bye-bye.